Oh, hey, how's it going? Good, how are you? Good. Are you ready for your 73 questions? Yeah, I'm ready. All right, let's start. Okay. What is your name? My name is Rachel Weil. And what kind of doctor are you? Psychiatry resident. And where are you from? Flemington, New Jersey. Did you know as a kid that you wanted to be a doctor? I always knew I would do something in healthcare. What did you study in college? Biology and Spanish. Did you take any time off before starting med school? No. Where did you go to med school? I went to Rowan SOM. And were you a PBL or an SGL student? SGL. Was there a professor at Rowan SOM that especially influenced you? I really liked Dr. Padolan. Did you do any research when you were in med school? I did a short research project with Dr. German. What was your core rotation hub site? I did my rotations at Atlanticare. Besides psychiatry, of course, what was your favorite rotation? I liked my NICU rotation. And what kind of electives did you do in your fourth year? I did a lot of psychiatry electives, and I also did a pathology elective. If you hadn't done psychiatry, is there another specialty that you think you would have been happy in? I think I would have been happy doing internal medicine. What stands out the most for you from your time at SOM? All the friends I made. What kind of physician did you think you were going to be when you started med school? GI. When did you know that you wanted to be in psychiatry? My third year during my psychiatry rotation. What would you say is the most unique thing about psychiatry? There's such a wide variety of pathologies and you're never bored. And how long is your residency training? Four years. So how is intern year going? It's going well. What would you say your aha moment was this year when you realized, wow, I'm a doctor now? I think introducing myself as Dr. Weil took some getting used to. And so, I guess, where are we right now? We are walking around Jefferson's campus. And if you could think of a moment that was, if you could think of a moment that would fit into your blooper reel of intern year, what would it be? I think hanging out with my co-residents. What service are you, are you on right now? Currently on emergency medicine, so something not psychiatry related. How's that going? It's going well. I like it. Can you share a common stereotype about psychiatry? Um, I think people think psychiatrists are all old men with glasses. Would you agree with this stereotype? No. Do you have a pre-work ritual or routine? Just making sure I drink coffee. Where are you completing your residency? Thomas Jefferson University. And do you live here in Philly or do you commute? I live in Philly. My commute is a 10 minute walk. What would you say is the best thing about Jefferson Psych? The people. What's the population that you get to serve here at Jefferson? We serve a really wide population. I think intern year is mostly um, super diverse population since we're in Center City. What does a typical day look like for you? It really depends on the rotation I'm on. Um, so it really changes month to month, just like med school. So you just got to work. What's the first thing you do? Um, log on to the computer and sign in. Do you ever have to take calls as a psychiatry resident? Yes, we both have 24-hour calls on the weekends and night float. How is psychiatry practice? What does that look like in the hospital? Really depends on the rotation, um, but first year we're mostly in the inpatient unit, um, so rounding on patients and making changes to their medications as needed. Where are we right now? Can you point out some of these buildings for us? Yeah, we're um, at Jeffer one of Jefferson's buildings. So I work in the building um, over there. Um, one of our offices is on the 16th floor, so there's a really beautiful view of the city. Awesome, thank you. What would you say you are most known for at work? Um, I don't know if I'm known for anything yet. I'm gonna try to keep it that way. <laughs> What's one quality that you think every psychiatrist should have? Good listener. Is there a question that you like to ask medical students that rotate with you? I like to ask them what they're interested in and then take teaching from there. What's something you were pimped on recently? I think reading a chest x-ray. What are your professional and research interests within psychiatry? I'm really interested in women's mental health as well as first break psychosis. What's the most cutting edge thing that you see is going on in psychiatry today? I think different treatments besides medication, so things like TMS and ECT. What's a memorable case that you've encountered recently? The memorable case I had was treating a pregnant patient on our inpatient psychiatry unit. 
So far, what's been your favorite rotation of intern year? My favorite rotation has been working on our inpatient unit, 14 Thompson. Do you get to do many procedures in psychiatry? Not um, during intern year. Um, as we uh, go up in the years, we can participate in ECT, which is a procedure. What would you be doing right now if you hadn't gone into medicine at all? Be an event planner. What's your favorite guilty pleasure seasonal drink at Starbucks? Um, chestnut praline latte. How do you unwind or relax when you get home after a shift? Currently watching Love is Blind. How much free time do you get as an intern? Like, like I said before, med school depends on the month. What would you say your favorite thing to do is when you're not at work? Um, hanging out with friends and trying to get outside. Is there a TV show that you could watch on repeat and never get tired of? Um, Schitt's Creek. Is there any podcast that you enjoy listening to? Armchair Expert. So, what do you think of the new Taylor Swift album? Love it. I just got Taylor Swift tickets today. I'm so excited. I am so jealous that you got <laughs> tickets. I did not. What was the, uh, the top of your Spotify rap this year? Taylor Swift. What was your first job? Working as a lifeguard. Do you have a favorite comfort food? Um, sushi. I ask everybody this question. Does pineapple belong on pizza? No. Can you tell me about a book that you read recently? Currently re reading a book called Lessons in Chemistry. Very good. It's not about chemistry. What is a skill that most people would be surprised to know you have? Um, I can cook. <laughs> If you could change one thing in medicine today, what would it be? Um, having, being able to spend more time with patients. What's been your biggest challenge to getting to where you are today? Um, I think getting over all of the obstacles in med school, but Rowan has prepared me well. What scares you? A lot of things. What are you most proud of? Getting to where I am today. What motivates you the most? I have a very strong internal drive of motivation. What role have mentors played in your personal and professional life? Yeah, a lot of mentors in psychiatry um, have helped me get to where I am today. What do you recommend for med students that are looking for a mentor? I think just talking to attendings, especially on your third year rotations and letting them know that you're interested in their field. What would you say to someone who's applying to medical school right now? You have a long road ahead of you, but it's worth it and keep going. What would you say to someone that's getting ready to start clerkships? Be very nice to everyone around you and try to help out. What would you say to someone that's getting ready to start residency? Enjoy your time off before you start residency and you know more than you think you know. What's next for you post-residency? A job. <laughs> what do you see yourself doing after medicine? I think after residency, getting a job, not sure in what area of psychiatry yet. And what would you say to the aspiring psychiatrist? It's a great field um, and welcome. All right, Dr. Weil, thank you so much. Thank you.